सात नंबर जर्सी पहनने वाले धोनी अंतर्राष्ट्रीय क्रिकेट से रिटायर हो गए हैं इसी के साथ दिनेश कार्तिक और मोहम्मद कैफ समेत क्रिकेट के दिग्गजों और फैंस ने धोनी की नंबर सात जर्सी को भी रिटायर करने की मांग की है इससे पहले सचिन तेंदुलकर की जर्सी नंबर दस को भी रिटायर किया जा चुका है कार्तिक ने लिखा कि उम्मीद है बीसीसीआई वनडे और टी ट्वेंटी में जर्सी नंबर सात को रिटायर करेगी कैफ ने लिखा कि टीम इंडिया की जर्सी नंबर सात में धोनी के बाद किसी और को देखने की सोच भी नहीं सकते हैं। धोनी ने जर्सी नंबर सात पहनकर ही टीम को टेस्ट रैंकिंग में नंबर वन बनाया था साथ ही वनडे और टी का वर्ल्ड कप भी जिताया Here we go, last ball to the outside, running through, it could be run out. Is he run out? Or is he in? We'll go upstairs, some good work from Tony, he thinks he's got him. Bear with me, gentlemen. Decision pending. He's got him. That's it. India win. What a comeback from India. They were gone in the last over. Can you believe they've beaten Bangladesh by a run? Bangladesh had it. The other legacy he'll leave, though, is uh, the way power hitting became in vogue in the end of one day games, and T20 games for that matter. Um, certainly playing against him in one day cricket when I was playing, if you got 250 to 280, that was pretty much a, a winning score. But Whenever we played India, if Dhoni was still there, no score was safe because he just had this amazing power uh, that he could hit any bowler um, out of the ground uh, at the end of an inning. So I think seeing this, uh, other teams seeing the success of Dhoni doing that, they started to try and develop players uh, in the same mould. So I think, I think he was probably one of the first pioneers of, of power hitting uh, in, that came into the game.